equipment gear used on this past week's Central Wisconsin Flowage Muskies. My first fish, well it came on a new crankbait by Lunge and Lures. And this is a new bait right here by Lunge and Lure. It's their 22 short, but with a really cool feature, it's got a shallow diving lip on it now, which um, is gonna be real interesting. I did throw this uh, PMTT down in Cave Run, and um, boy, I really like the action of it, and you can run it real shallow. So that's what I'm gonna do. White is always a good color here. It's dark stained water. It has a short lip on it that allows this bait to run in super shallow water. Ideal for early spring muskies. Another lure that shined was a new bucktail by Musky Mayhem. It's called the Single Girl. What I had my luck on was the new Single Girl by Musky Mayhem. This thing's put a lot of fish. I think it's five, six fish now in the boat for us this year. It's a single blade, it's a fluted blade, and it really gives off a, a very unique vibration that I don't think these muskies are, uh, obviously, uh, they, they like it, and they're not afraid of it, that's for sure, so give that a try for sure. I also threw this by Team Rhino, it's their jackrabbit, and uh, it's an extra weight in there, so it gets down a little bit deeper. Did uh, actually raise quite a few fish and had a bite on this. This is the jackrabbit by TRO, really another good quality bait to be used in a situation like this as well. I also threw a lot of top water and had several blow ups. Use it. So what I'm throwing right now is uh, by Lake X, and top water should be the trick. A little overcast, a little chop, shallow water. We'll see what happens here, but top water is one of the funnest ways of catching muskies. You get to see the whole thing go down. There's a top water company in northern Wisconsin that produces some of the best top water on the muskie scene, Lake X. They have a complete line of top water with different sizes, with each of them having their own unique sound, from a higher pitch to a low thumping vibration. And their top water water displacement is incredible. When muskies commit to Lake X top water, they just crush it. Very hot conditions were beating down on me. The temperature, it hit 100 degrees. You know, I had a lot of fun, even though it was 100 degrees today. Unbelievable. And I'll tell you what, this Sims clothing, dude, it was 100 degrees today and I couldn't take it. I was in a t-shirt. I put this shirt on and I put the, the sun scarf that they make on and it was like 100 degrees and I was comfortable. It's, uh, that's what it's all about, keeping that sun from beating on you. But the Sims clothing, very, very impressed with it. Very, very satisfied. Well worth the money. Like I mentioned, it was 100 degrees. Staying properly hydrated is super important. This is where Ingle Coolers, well, it's what they were made for, for keeping our drinks and food cold in the hottest of days. Do me a favor, the next time you're looking to replace a cooler, check them out, go online and compare their pricing to other name brands. You'll be shocked. And I'll tell you what, their gear is really heavy duty made and it just works. Sight fishing is a big part of early spring muskie fishing. This is the only time of the year where these muskies go ultra shallow. Having the right pair of sunglasses is critical. H3O polarized sunglasses allows us to do just that. Their interchangeable lens design allows for the proper lens for all kinds of lighting. And their polar clear lens allows us to wear our glasses right up till dark, but still removing that low light glare, allowing us to see follows that just weren't possible before. Amazing technology.